Sanyong have been around since 1954. Uh, back then, they actually used to build jeep for the army. It's only 1988 they went into the business to providing car for, of course, for private use and commercial, right? So this is Eddie, All right? I'm not a car expert. I'm actually sharing you. This is uh, not a sponsored video. I just bought a Samyon Tivori, and the reason why I'm sharing this car is because, uh, as you know, now the business is very bad. My car has not reached about nine year plus, so it's time to change. So I don't want to spend so much money to buy a new car. So I've been going, go around searching for a better catch, a better price, and also a better car. Upon chance, I came across this Samyong Tivoli. They have very flexible car loan. All right, even you want a zero drive away, they can actually do that for you. Their promotion keep running differently every three to four months. At this moment, I think there are other promotions that are running. So they have cashback. Uh, promotion they have zero down payment zero drive away it's literally for you guys to check on their website or their facebook what kind of promotion they have so this is a 1.6 and i never ever imagine myself driving a diesel car okay so it's the first time i'm driving a diesel car when the salesman told me it's a diesel i wasn't very sure that i wanted a diesel but of course uh, if i go for hybrid maybe it could be better 100 percent electric maybe it could be better too but I'm very worried about the charging point. That's why I decided to go for a diesel. So apparently a lot of people tell me that diesel save petrol, you go longer distance, and of course, the only thing set back is that road tax is a little bit more expensive. So previous car, one full tank, 120. I can go about 500 km. But this one, one full tank, 70, 80 dollar. I can go about 600, 650. Or sometimes even 700 it depends. I just I just picked up this car about two weeks ago, so uh, I'm just testing out. But I was very amazed by the power of the diesel car. When you step at the accelerator, it actually pick up very very fast. They actually changed total six logo. Okay, throughout I think since 1954 till today, right? So when they took over in 1988, it was a year of the dragon in the Chinese calendar. So in 2000, they actually designed this logo as the wing of a dragon. So it symbolized freedom, movement, and growth, which I think a lot of y'all may not know. Even probably the salesman don't even know. So if you look at the back of uh, the trolley, if you spell bad work, it's called I love it. It's actually, it, it's a little town in Italy. That's why it's called Tivoli, all right? So but if you spell bad word, it's actually called I love it, which you can actually see in the back of my car. Actually, I change it. I love it. Right. So if you can see the racing stripe, I do shout out for rep specialists for this amazing work that I actually go in within about two, two and a half hours. They actually got this sticker done for me with my company logo, the Six Productions. So I went for uh, groom work. It's also owned by a friend of mine. So we do uh, a layer of coating to protect the paint and of course the shine. Uh, apparently what I heard, that it actually can last about a year or so. But of course, in between every three months, four months, you know, if you're free and have the budget, please do go back there and get it polished again. So the car will always maintain shining. And um, of course, uh, it always look good if your car shining right. Yep, right. So the next thing I'll talk about is, all right, if you see the interior, of course, um, everybody know that it's actually uh, Apple Play, uh, Android, it's actually can hook up to your phone, so it's a mi 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 so called the mirror image that um, every function that you have. So things like even power window, auto, but the only setback is it doesn't auto close back. So you have to hold it there and slowly close back. Okay, then of course the side mirror, when you're off the engine, it doesn't close back also. Okay, so if you want to close back manually, you have to close back itself. Okay, other than that, I'm quite happy with the whole interior itself. Um, very neat, very slick, very tidy, uh, a lot of room space. And of course, uh, the armrest, also a big space inside that can store my thing. Of course, the growth apartment. Uh, I, the key is actually very bulky. This is the key. It's very huge. So the only thing I realized, so every time I park my car, uh, one side to either to buy a packet of drink or to draw money, right? As long as you have the key with you, the car will make a lot, a lot of noise. Okay, it will tell you that you didn't off the engine. Of course, for safety reason, yes. But the irritating part is when you just want to run in to grab something, right? The car makes a lot of noise. 
and um, there's this time I actually went up, uh, where I went out and topped up a petrol. Then I also realized with the key in my pocket when I walk away, it's actually auto locked. So after the the pump and tendon top up petrol, he cannot actually close back, you know, the cover. Okay, so uh, I didn't know until I drove back that I realized my cover had been actually opened. Okay, so that's that's a that's a setback. Other than that, um, everything seems okay. Um, there's several like to choose from uh, on the on the console itself. You can actually choose any color that you like. I think if I'm not wrong, it should be about eight colors. Then of course the sickness sound. If I'm not mistaken, I think there's also about eight sickness sound that you actually can customize you know, for your liking. So other than this cruise control, um, yeah, nothing much. It's very simple, simple fight. And uh, I like everything to be simple because too high tech. I also have no time to go and learn all these things. There we have it, Sangyong Tivori. Um, go check it out. I think it's a really good buy. And uh, yes, uh, for for my company to go out to photo shoot, is I, I can able able to look up uh, a lot of equipment. So now, I'll show a little bit of how the bed space look like. Okay, let's go. Right, so this is a bed space that uh, I was talking about. So, yep, um, not that big, but it's enough for me to go, for, go up for a production shoot and stuff like that. So apparently, all this seat, it can be folded down uh, to be flat. So, but I'm not going to show you. Please, again, go to their website and take a look at it. Right, so if, if you have not enough space, you can just put it up and store uh, a, a little bit small, a little item inside. So if you don't need the spare tire, you actually can take out the spare tire, get even more book space. So it's up to individual that what you need. Right, there we have it. Uh, Sanyong Tivoli. And uh, it's my first time doing a car review. And uh, like I said again, I'm not going to for test drive. Those who really want, please call the agent up, uh, hit them up, and, uh, or maybe I can share the agent name below. Uh, hit him up, nice guy. He always try to reach out uh, as much discount as he can and things like that. Motorway is the distributor of this Sangyong. All right. So under Motorway, I just realized they actually have their in-house finance. So basically, you don't need to go bank to bank to compare or see whether your loan approved or not. So all you need to do is just to submit, of course, your, your income tax report, your pay slip, right? They can work out the monthly installment plan for you. So there we have it um, so far about my car. I actually like the back light just in case you guys don't really see. I think this design was a few years back by, if not mistaken, by Porsche. Uh, a few years back, actually Porsche, one of the car got something like that. All right, so I kind of like the back light. Uh, very, very interesting. So, yep, there we have it. This is Eddie uh, from Six Production signing off.